Okay, I'm going to demonstrate the new uh, visual phrase analysis system from Tin Man Systems. Just go to webaigent.com. Um, actually, you don't need to enter anything else, and you'll go to the index page. There are two examples for natural language processing. Um, we have a video already on the online thesaurus, uh, but this is the new one, visual phrase analysis. Just select this one, and you'll go to this page here. Um, and uh, you can enter in any phrase uh, that you want. This is a test phrase. And then click on Analyze Phrase. And what it'll do is just go through and scan and get all the single um, uh, standalone words, uh, give you the number of occurrences, but also parse uh, forward and backward on each word to give a collection of word phrases that are found and give you some quick stats on that. Um, additionally, uh, there's a visual tool down here uh, which is a diagram of all the unique words um, as they relate to each other and are found within that phrase. Now this isn't very meaningful right now because uh, we have a very short phrase but if we were to, um, let's just use the sample phrase, it's already built in, uh, you can enter it up to a thousand words in length. Um, this is uh, something we just uh, created uh, for your testing, easy testing. Uh, but let's analyze this phrase, you can see that we found 90 words, 90 unique words uh, six, uh, excuse me, 90 total words, 62 unique words, and um, 78 unique phrases. And uh, we can see the most common word and the most common phrase. Now this isn't really rocket science, but it is kind of useful and interesting. Uh, but down here is of particular interest, and this is the diagram that shows all unique words in that phrase, and it shows their interrelationship. So if we zeroed in on the word you, we can see that, uh, uh, let's see, you... Uh, was found six times. Uh, we have to go down here. Uh, was found six times, and um, and I can see all the forward, the previous and following words. Now, if I double click on this word, and you can move this around as well, and we can take off the grid lines so that you can see a little bit better. Turn on the backlight, and double click on you, and we can see the words that preceded you and the words that follow you. And uh, you can double click on these and just kind of continue to traverse um, this phrase. But this is just a way to see uh, on any unique word found within that long phrase exactly what precedes it and what is the frequency of that word that precedes it. And the same thing for words that follow it. So everything to the left here are words that pre preceded the word phrase. And there were five, looks like five or six occurrences of that. Uh, there were two times that the uh, phrase button occurred. I can double click on button and continue to traverse, or I can go back to phrase and uh, continue to traverse. But uh, let's go ahead and reset that. And so you can see this is kind of the universe of all words that occurred in that uh, phrase. Uh, anyway, new tool, uh, continued development. We're just exposing some of the things that um, uh, we have as standing technology and uh, feel free to hit our uh, main website tinmansystems.com uh, for a more complete breakdown. In fact, if you go back to this page and you click on the professional services page, you get a breakdown of all the types of projects and how we work with companies. Anyway, uh, thank you very much. Uh, that's a quick example for you.